What's going on guys, and welcome to the next Forza Thon Weekly Challenge. In this video, I'll be showing you a basic run through of the challenges that bank you 100 Forza points. You can also double your rewards if you own this location on the map, which is located on the top left. Before we dig into the challenges, let's take a look into the weekly Forza Thon shop. For this week, we really don't have much going on inside the shop, but let me run through it anyways. We have the Forza Edition Volkswagen bus that deals speed boost on drag tires. We also have the return of the Honda Civic CRX with two clothing items. Then for seasonal events, it's a great week in my opinion. The regalia from Final Fantasy has returned to Horizon and there's also a crazy off-road version hidden inside the car mastery area. Whenever you unlock the stock version, you need to waste 133 points inside the car mastery area to unlock the Type D variation. We also have another vehicle returning, but it's new to Horizon 4, and that's a 1994 Fair Lady Z, or Zed, wherever you want to say it. If that's not your thing, then the Hot Wheels Bone Shaker has returned for another round. As for Fortune Island, it's the same as always, meaning nothing is worth completing over there unless you want normal wheel spins. From what Playground has mentioned from the livestream of Season 6, things on the island will be changing eventually with prizes, so just a heads up on that. Anyways, let's go dig into the challenges. In the first challenge, you own and drive the Jag XJ220, one of the most iconic vehicles of its era. Now this vehicle is a barn find item. If you haven't found the barn, then I do have a video that shows you all the locations. But if you don't want to do that and just want to buy one, then go buy it off the auction house for around 100,000 to 400,000 credits. Whenever you do attain one, then go outside with the vehicle and drive around the block until the challenge pops up. For a second challenge, you need to win three dirt trial events while using this vehicle. Here you have two options. You can either do normal layouts across the map, or you can set up a custom race with the track editor. I do have one created over by the seasonal event, but make sure to switch to a normal event to find my custom race if you are following me on Forza. For a third challenge, you need to drive your XJ220 for 20 miles across the map. I would just blast up and down the highway a few times until you unlock it. For a final challenge, you need to achieve 220 miles an hour while driving your XJ220. Here I would seriously upgrade your vehicle because the car will have a hard time attaining it bone stock. Yes, the car should reach at speed like the real life version, but it's better to slightly upgrade it. Well, that pretty much wraps up everything that you need to know in this week in Horizon 4. From here, I hope you found this pretty useful, and I'll see you next time.